CAD Maker's Virtual Construction is an integrated construction technology company. The kind of experience we create for our customers is a fit for purpose experience, meaning we're going to deliver a service and a product with the 3D Experience platform that's going to you know, make sure they mac we maximize the value of our time and deliver real measurable results. We started the company to solve a problem with coordination in large, complex construction projects. And the tool that we chose to use for that tool is Katia with the 3D Experience platform. We think there's a lot of best practices that can be leveraged from other industries, most notably manufacturing and aerospace, that we could apply uh, in a unique way to construction. The problem that we try to solve is getting multiple stakeholders, multiple technology platforms, 2D, 3D, and advancements in all those areas to try to come in together in one place and be able to identify constructability challenges ahead of live construction so that you can put in actionable plans and solve those problems prior to having people on site. We use Katia because it's uh, very good for very large, complex assemblies. It provides the most flexibility, which is what we need in AEC because no two projects are the same, both from a design perspective and the team that's working on it. What CAD Makers is able to do is using CATIA, they will import all of the drawings from the various consultants, the architect, the structural engineer, the mechanical engineer, uh, the electrical engineer, and they take all those separate drawings and consolidate them all into a 3D model that has been virtually constructed. Traditionally, there's been lots of what's called design bid built. You have the design team designs it, contractor bids it, and then they build it. Contractually, they're separated and um, some cases are actually motivated to not really work well together. And that's very much changing. There's been some movements just recently with the, more of an integrated project delivery work from day one. Contractors, designers were on the same team. We do believe that's going to be more of a trend, specifically on larger projects where there's a lot of risk. We start sharing the risk, but also the rewards. The Aquatic Center is a project where we use the 3D Experience platform to coordinate drawings prior to construction. And what we found is that it identified a number of issues. With the additional time we've had, we've been able to get in front of a lot of problems that we otherwise normally wouldn't have seen until much later. So you have the architect, the designers, and the, the contractors sitting in front of our model and walking through potential problems and then being able to crowdsource solutions in the room. By having an additional set of eyes and a different stream of coordination, what we're finding is by integrating CAD makers into the normal design process, everyone benefits. It's helping us avoid potential issues. For example, when we're going on site, a lot of the conflicts and issues that we bring up it's because of the complexity of these buildings and the complexity of the project. But having the 3D and actually put, showing them, these are the ducts, this is the wall, these are the columns, this is how everything fits together, and this is why your duct is below the ceiling, is a powerful tool in terms of just representing the data. CATIA is one of those platforms that has the ability to view one central model, and that's where the value really is. My favorite aspect about CATIA and Delmia is the idea that you can create scripts. You have the ability to take on your own creativity and your own genius to create tools with scripting. That opens up the possibilities and actually creates efficiencies and workflow. So you don't end up doing the same thing over and over again, and that can be brought up across all the projects. For us, we like to be on the front end and be the company that figures out the best application of the software. It's like a science to applied science. The so systems is the science, and we want to be the applied science. Okay, how do we take it and use it to solve real problems on the front line for our customers and get the most use out of it and scale that to a larger population? Yeah.